I have a question about a song on 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 toxic masculinity. Mm -hmm. I'm a man, number eight. Yeah. Talk to me about that. What was the driving force behind that song? So that track started out with, that started out with just the track at first. I made the beat. Um, Meeks really liked the track, and um, I want to say. I want to say he, that might have been the second verse he wrote for that song. But um, we were like halfway in, almost finished with the album. We still felt like we needed a song that kind of tied in really well with the um, title of the album and the, mm. and the whole concept of the album. Um, we had already did a couple of other songs that might would take people this way or that way or where they might not fully understand or be able to bring the... the um, the, the topic, the subject of toxic max masculinity all the way uh, full circle. And um, our thing is that as far as toxic masculinity is concerned, it's like you can't really have the both at the same time. Like if, if you're a man, you're not going to you can't be toxic and be a man. That's not a man. It's impossible. Uh, correct. Correct. So it's like a real man is not a toxic person. A real man is going to take care of his family. He's not going to a real man is not going to be beaten on some on women. You know, a real man. That's just a toxic person. That's yes, not a that's a toxic, toxic person. Man, that's, that's not a man. Exactly. So, so that was our thing. That's why we said we need to show we need to let people know what a man is and you mm -hmm. know, kind of bring that full circle. And um that's when uh I believe Meeks actually came up with his verse first and um we figured out how to really bring the hook together. I brought the Farrakhan clip in. Mm -hmm. and, and um he wrote the first verse and we would you know, we loved the direction it was going. And um, we was we was like, you know, what's next? Like, you know, what's the next verse going to be? You know, should I write a verse or what's going? And we just sat back and thought. I was like, no, nah, I don't want to write a verse for this song. Um, the, the type of track it is, I just didn't really, I wasn't feeling anything specific for myself. And uh, he was like, man, I'd like to get some features on. He said, what about a feature on here? And I was like, well, let's try to figure it out. And, um, you know, while he was thinking on his end, I made a couple of calls 